Little Compton is a town in Newport County, Rhode Island between the Saconet River and the Massachusetts state border. It is the birthplace of the Rhode Island Red Hen. History Little Compton was originally inhabited by the Saconet Indians. The name has been interpreted in a variety of ways including, "...where the water pours forth". The first colonial settlers in Little Compton were from Duxbury, Massachusetts in the Plymouth Colony, which granted them their charter. They divided the land into lots of standard sizes and began settling there. Among these 32 original proprietors was Colonel Benjamin Church, who was well known for his role in the late 17th century conflicts with surrounding Indian tribes, notably the Narragansetts and Wampanoags. In 1675, Church built his homestead in Little Compton, just prior to King Philip's War. Today, a plaque on the side of West Main Road gives the location of his original homestead. In 1682, Saconet was incorporated by the Plymouth Colony and renamed Little Compton, probably in reference to Cullumpton, Devon, England. By 1747, Little Compton secured its own royal decree and was annexed to Newport County as a part of Rhode Island along with Tiverton and Bristol. All probate and land records prior to 1746 can be found in Taunton and New Bedford, Massachusetts because Little Compton was once part of the Plymouth Colony. Sites of historic interest in Little Compton include the Wilbur House, built in 1692 by Samuel Wilbur and now the home of the Little Compton Historical Society. The entire town commons is also on the National Register of Historic Places. There are about 57 historic cemeteries in the town. Benjamin Church and his family are buried in the Little Compton Commons Cemetery, as is Elizabeth Pabody, the eldest daughter of John Alden and Priscilla Mullins of Mayflower fame. The stones in the cemetery reflect a style of carving similar to that found both in Newport and in Boston during the same time period. Little Compton is the location for one of three town commons in Rhode Island. The others are in Warren and Bristol. This is most likely a result of the town having been originally laid out by settlers from the Plymouth and Massachusetts colonies. Land for the common was designated in August 1677 and has been used ever since as both a religious and civic center for social activities in the town, as well as private events such as weddings and funerals. The commons contain a large cemetery. Another distinctive feature of the town is the circa 1905 Spite Tower, found in the village of Adamsville. Built as a water tower, local law claims that it was constructed to obscure the line of sight of a town local. Fort Church was built near Saconet Point during World War II and was named for Benjamin Church. The largest of the four batteries was Battery Gray with two 16-inch guns, an area that became the Saconet Golf Club. <laughs> <laughs> Demographics As of the census of 2000, there were 3,593 people, 1,475 households, and 1,041 families residing in the town. The population density was 172.1 people per square mile per square kilometers. There were 2,103 housing units at an average density of 100.7 per square miles .9 per square kilometers. The racial makeup of the town was 98.75% white, 0.06% African American, 0.19% Native American, 0.22% Asian, 0.08% Pacific Islander, 0.06% from other races, and 0.64% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race was 0.86% of the population. There were 1,475 households out of which 27.7% had children under the age of 18 living with them, 60.7% were married couples living together, 6.8% had a female householder with no husband present, and 29.4% were non-families, 24.5% of all households were made up of individuals and 11.7% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. 
The average household size was 2.44 and the average family size was 2.92. In the town, the population was spread out with 21.7% under the age of 18, 5.1% from 18 to 24, 25.7% from 25 to 44, 29.8% from 45 to 64, and 17.7% .7 who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 44 years. For every 100 females, there were 97.3 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 93.1 males. The median income for a household in the town was $75,368, and the median income for a family was $102,750. Males had a median income of $63,199 versus a median income of $38,676 for females. The per capita income for the town was $52,513. About 3.7% of families and 3.4% of the population were below the poverty line, including 1.0% of those under the age of 18 and 2.4% of those 65 and older. Geography <laughs> 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 According to the United States Census Bureau, the town has a total area of 28.9 square miles, 75 square kilometers, of which 20.9 square miles, 54 square kilometers is land and 8.0 square miles, 21 square kilometers, 27.79% is water. One of the largest bodies of water in Little Compton is Quicksand Pond. A part of Little Compton is Saconet Point, which is the town's southernmost point. Saconet Point has views of multiple rocky islands off of the coast, as well as the Saconet Lighthouse. Education There is only one school in Little Compton, the Wilbur and McMahon School. It was originally known as the Josephine Wilbur School. It had 12 classrooms and housed the town's K-12 facilities. It was renamed after additions were built in the mid-1900s. Approximately 350 students attend classes in kindergarten through eighth grade. Located in the center of town, the residents simply refer to it as, "...Wilbur School." High school students usually attend Portsmouth High School in Portsmouth, Re. <laughs> Rhode Island Red The Rhode Island Red is a breed of chicken originally bred in Adamsville, a small village that is part of Little Compton. Little Compton is the only place in the United States with a monument dedicated to a chicken. In 1925, the Rhode Island Red Club of America donated funds for an elegant monument to the Rhode Island Red in Adamsville, near the baseball field and across the street from the barn restaurant. The monument is now on the National Register of Historic Places. A competing monument to the Rhode Island Red was erected by the state in 1954, one mile south of Adamsville. Some claim that it was not created for the poultry fanciers, but for the farmers who raised them commercially in great numbers in Little Compton. Notable people Topic. Attractions and sites on National Register of Historic Places Wilbur House Museum 1692. Friends Meeting House and Cemetery 1815. Little Compton Common Historic District Rhode Island Red Monument 1925. Saconet Light Station 1884. Stone House Inn 1854. William Worley Homestead Little Compton Community Center Topic See also Rhode Island Portal